sure that ACE has been in existence, which is the uh, Commuter Engagement Association on campus, and we were talking a lot about ways to engage commuter students. There hadn't been much programming done for them before, so we talked about it first just having uh, a day long of events, but realized there were so many different things we were trying to bring into engaging and educating commuter students that we made it into a week. The puppy rescue shelter dogs, the therapy dogs that came were a great stress reliever for students. The giveaways, of course, were very successful. The students loved the t-shirts and we had lunch totes and lunch bags and grocery bags and all types of things. We served uh, granola bars and fruit and different types of things and coffee and tea and hot chocolate. And the students really loved that. That was bright and early, 8 a.m. in the parking lot. They all had great turnout, um, given that it was the first year that these things happened. Even when we had the car on the middle of the Infinity Quad and students were learning how to change a flat tire, um, it, you know, people got something out of everything. I think if there's one thing that I would want everyone to take away from Commuter Spirit Week and the purpose of ACE on campus is that we are paying attention to the commuter population, the needs that these students have, and this is such a very large portion of RIT's community that's been very untapped and hasn't had a lot of outreach for before. that this organization is for the commuter students and for their voice. So bring your voices out, let's hear what we have to say, and let's make RIT a very welcoming and embracing campus for our community population.